morning guys um it's monday um we had a kind of boring weekend um but some interesting things happened as well that i'll let you in on a little later i am making coffee right now but you know those mornings when you wake up and you're like oh it's really hard to wake up um, which <laughs> you can't have hard mornings to wake up when you have a puppy because they need to go outside But I woke up and I was like, oh my god We forgot to do dishes last night. And so there's a pile of dishes in the sink That I don't want to do and I'm gonna have to do them in the next little while but I'm just gonna have my coffee and wake up for now and Kind of go from there and of course this one woke me up so that she could go back to sleep. You wake me up so you could go back to sleep. So why are we awake? I gotta cut your nails. You don't like me when I cut your nails, do you? I gotta cut your nails. <laughs> I'm not one to do like a lot of face face masks or facials and stuff like that but when I was washing my face I saw this um, sitting in the cupboard and I was like I haven't done a face mask in a while so I'm gonna put on a face mask <laughs> Welcome to the not so scary masked Julia. Um, so I actually had that mask on my face, and the neighbor knocked on my door to tell me to ask me if I was like doing laundry or taking a shower, or if anyone in the house was. And I said, "No, why?" And she took me outside to show me this. Isn't that super weird? So here we live on a septic tank. Everyone around the lake does. So that makes me think that someone's septic tank is backing up or so a septic tank, how it works is it like has pipes that run out into what's called a leach field that dis disperses liquid and then solids and bad stuff stays back in the septic tank and it gets pumped every once in a while. But that kind of makes me think that it's someone's septic tank is backing up and I don't think it's ours because A, we had ours pumped recently, B, our yard isn't soapy or wet at all. We actually haven't had any rain recently so our yard is not wet. And when the neighbor asked like, are you doing laundry or are you having a shower? I wasn't, there was absolutely nothing going on. I, was, I had that mask on my face, I was sitting on my computer. There was nothing going on so I'm really confused as to like what it could be, but I guess I'll talk to more of the neighbors um, today and like see, but that's just super weird. I'm not gonna let karma go swimming or anything today. Just, cause it's so strange. And like, I don't know if you could see it, but it kind of went like all the way down the bay. So maybe it was, maybe it was further down and like not anywhere in our little neighborhood's areas, but um, someone. A little bit further down the lake and it's just kind of congregating at my house right now but yeah super weird what do you have did mommy give you an ear did mommy give you a cow so cow's ear do you like it
we're trying blue buffalo blue bits. Um, they're a little bit big for training treats, so we break them in half. But she's doing pretty good with her training, coming along. Um, she's not super food motivated, so it's hard to find treats that she likes. Like these aren't even great for her. We found one treat that she really likes. So we're gonna get more of those. So Karma is in PetSmart beginner class. Um, she's too old to be in the puppy class because she was a rescue. So we didn't put her in puppy class, we put her in beginner. Um, she so far has sit and lie down, down. Like she can do those with and without food. We still try and reward her to her, remind her like, we really like this, we really like this. She's learning uh, come, which she's coming. She's got it coming around too. Um, we've just recently started stay and she doesn't really, ooh, drop the camera. She doesn't really like stay yet um, or understand how to do it. We are teaching her stand because we think it's cute. Um, yeah, she has two more weeks. So next week we're working on leave it. And then she has her test the week after that and then she graduates and she's such a good girl. Um, also in class we've worked on some like meeting other dogs, manners, meeting other people. In last class we they brought in another employee of PetSmart and had them like say hi it was the command and learn how to um, greet people nicely and she's not a jumper but the other dog in our class is so it was a good lesson anyway she's rather timid so it was nice um, and now she's gonna get a different kind of treat frozen treat since it's hot So this is blueberries and bananas frozen into an ice cube. You want this? Oh yes, you want this. Come here. There you go. There you go. <laughs> I gave her back her ear after some training and she's really happy. Are you really happy? You like your ear. You're so cute. Come on, Karma. Let's go. Come do a fun thing. Stick with your face. Oh, it's colder up here.
And then here's the calm after the storm. Right, Karma? Why don't you tell the people why you're in your old blue harness? Is it because you chewed through your purple one? Hmm? Did you chew through your purple harness? The mommy had to go on the phone with customer service to get you another one. Yeah, so Karma uses an easy walk harness and I left her with it on it with left it on her for 10 minutes without observing her. And yeah, it's chewed through. So the people at Pet Safe, um, who are the makers of Easy Walk Harness, were super nice and really, really helpful. Uh, their customer service team was really, really helpful, and we managed to figure out a way to get it replaced, and it's being shipped out, and hopefully we'll have it in the next few days. Karma, want to say bye-bye to the people? Bye, guys. Bye, guys. <laughs> Night, baby. Night, guys.